I don't know where to start. I grew up in the kind of church that was very music driven, very art driven. Sometimes our pastor would start singing in church at the beginning of church and two hours would go by and he would say, okay, go home. And he never got to preaching because that was where he was led. So for me, that's where I learned to sing, dance, and act. I started acting professionally when I was really young. So I was like four. I didn't like to show my voice off. And I guess my mom's like, I know you can sing. I'm gonna make you, <laughs> I'm gonna make you sing. You're gonna have an audition for a musical. I was like, no, I don't wanna do it. But I loved singing and so, my mom gave me that extra push. I'm a very emotional person, and I care a lot about people, and I love telling a story. I'm more of a performer. Ryan's the artist. Anytime? OK. Baby, I've tried, but I can't love you. You know you got your hooks in my soul. Feels like I'm tying slowly all because you. And your love will never let me go. <sighs> Singing, I don't know, I can't really put it into words how important it is to me. Because at this point, it's kind of just like another limb to my body. And that was always a dream. Like from a kid up until now, it still is pretty much the same thing. I just always knew what I wanted to do. I never steered off into any other direction. It was always about what's your purpose? What's your purpose? That was the message to me as a kid. You have to live for a reason. You know, I'm afraid of a lot of things. This is the one thing I don't have fear of. I'm a big perfectionist, and sometimes it gets in my way. But knowing that it's OK for me to make mistakes throughout this whole journey. Every time someone looks up to an artist, it's because they connect it with them in some sort of way. And I think without those mistakes, people wouldn't be able to connect with you. And your love will never let me go. I feel like everybody feels like they're the only one going through things. I did when I was a kid. I thought I'm for sure the only one going through this. Right now, I feel very excited to move forward and see where my life takes me. My parents didn't take me seriously with my singing until like middle school. And then that's when they were like, oh, she actually can, you know, do stuff. I remember hearing Yellow Brick Road by Eminem. And he said, I get my ass kicked damn near everywhere from Bel Air Shopping Center just for stopping in there from the black side all the way to the white side. And I remember thinking for the first time in my life that somebody understood me. And that became what I wanted to do. Oh,